have you ever wondered how does my mobile get charged or what is the circuit present inside the charger or what is the role of rectifier in a mobile charger to know the answers continue watching hi this is benila i make videos based on engineering concept if you are into this consider subscribing in this modern world the uses of portable devices like mobile laptop camera electronic watches power bank and tablets have increased in fact most of you would be using mobile phone for watching this video the important question that we ask ourselves while leaving the home might be did i take my charger with me yes charger has successfully managed to take part in all our travel checklist first let's come to our first question how does my mobile get charged lithium ion batteries are used in most of our mobiles the cathode of lithium ion battery is made of lithium metal oxide the anode is made of graphite they are separated by an electrolyte the lithium present in the cathode have one valence electron when an external dc voltage is supplied the valence electron move towards the positive terminal of the battery and reaches anode now anode becomes more negative due to the extra electrons and lithium who lost its electron becomes more positive so they move towards anode through the electrolyte after all the lithium reaches anode the battery is considered fully charged main thing to consider here is the external supply applied is dc supply but the electrical supply we have in our home is ac now you might have guessed the answer for the second question what is the circuit present in the charger of course you are right one of the circuit present in the charger is ac to dc converter rectifier is the circuit which converts ac voltage to dc voltage Mobile charger is not the only application of rectifier. Few other common application include electric vehicles, cranes, food mixers, welding, blowers, trains, vending machine, and washing machine. Now let's see the type of rectifiers. Based on the number of semiconductor devices used, the rectifiers are classified as half-wave converter, full-wave converter, and dual converters. based on the type of semiconductor devices used the rectifiers are classified as uncontrolled rectifier and controlled rectifier based on the type of input supply the rectifiers are classified as single phase converter and three phase converter in my upcoming videos i am going to discuss in depth about each type if you are interested in this don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon so that you will be notified each time i upload a video